everyone, this is HTDC How to Do Something in China. I am Price Day. Despite the convenience of delivery service in China, I personally enjoy shopping at supermarket. I schedule a grocery day every week. So today, I chose the world's number one supermarket, Walmart, and plan to show what are the prices like in China and how much money do we spend on grocery. Come and compare with me. Before we begin, I have a challenge today. I need to capture 188 press tags. Exactly 188. Not a single one less. If I lose, I need to eat Sir Stromy. Please supervise me. Today, the main section I'm focusing on is food. Challenge begins. Amazing price! We also have a lot of vegetables that are cut in small pieces, which is more suitable for a person like me who live alone and only need a little bit. How many lights collect? Let me count. Small donuts. Mini croissant. Here I miss you. Shrimp cracker. Oreo claw kick with filling. Oreo cookies, thin Oreo. Mini Oreo with panda on it. Steel Oreo and Oreo. Another Oreo. I thought this is an easy task, but 188 is just a big number. What? Because I like eight. Eight is a very lucky number, you remember? American pistachio. You guys have that in your country? Lace with 75 grams. Lace with 135 grams. Lace with different flavors. Lace with 220 grams. Lace with expensive version. Doritos. Cheetos
all of these candies are in this price. So if you want different kinds of them, you can just choose anything you like and put them in one bag. Very convenient. I don't know what to collect now. How many more do I have to go? Tw 20? 30? 30 to go! Go, go, go! Different kinds of tea. And there are 20 of them there. Does it count? Cantonian iced teas. It's a good partner with top pot and barbecues. Rebel. Coca Cola. Regular Coke. Diet Coke. Huge Coke. Super huge Coke. I think I complete my mission, but I still got something to buy. Cause you know, you never can walk out of supermarket with empty hand. Oh. Congratulations! Now you know the prices in Chinese big supermarkets. How do you think of the price? I think it's quite reasonable. And for fruits, vegetables and meat, we actually have places that are much cheaper. If you like this kind of series, please like and subscribe. I will update more next time. Okay, see you!